You may be seated. All right, parents, those of you who are dedicating babies, would y'all come on to the podium at this time? All of you come on that are dedicating your children this morning, y'all come on up. We're still waiting on Brother David. I'm going to let, uh, let you introduce yourself to our church and uh, introduce your little one, and then we'll uh, hopefully Brother David will be down by that time. Rodrigo and Jenny Sardinas, and this is Linda. Uh, Chris and Beth Wells, this is Chloe and Lucas. I'm Tanner Martin, this is my wife Amanda Martin, and this is Kinley Martin. Philip and Elizabeth Edwards, and this is Alexander and Ariane. Uh, Victoria Parker, and this is Devlin. grateful for you and for your children and uh, you've already been introduced so I'd like uh, to get the whole church along with you uh, to make some affirmations and then I'll get just you parents to make some okay all right church let's uh, let's if you will repeat after me uh, the following scriptures let the little children come unto me and forbid them not, for of such is the kingdom of heaven. For this child I prayed, and I tell you that whoever would cause one of these little ones to stumble, it would be better for him to have a boulder hung about his neck and cast into the midst of the sea. Well, folks, it's just such a joy always. We look forward to this every Mother's Day. And um, I'm going to ask you some questions. And uh, you parents, if you would, uh, in unison all together, uh, just say, I will, if you agree to these okay are you willing to pray for your child every day are you willing to set an example of what Christianity should be in front of your child are you willing to make a sacrifice to see that your child has opportunity of the things of God and will you do your best to see that your child is raised in the nurture and the admonition of the Lord? Well, it's a real pleasure uh, to, to have you introduced, and uh, I appreciate your affirmation to those truths. And uh, we're, we want to uh, have a word of prayer, a word of dedication. Uh, church, if you would just, where you're seated, hold hands across the... Uh, uh, congregation and uh, let me pray for these parents and these children father I just pray for each of these precious children there is no greater there is no greater gift than that of life.
I praise you for parents who believe that. I praise you for parents who will live before their children the kind of life that honors you. I praise you for parents who will seek to raise their children in the admonition of the Lord. And I praise you, Lord, for churches like this one and many others across uh, our area and across the country who do stand for life, who seek to protect little innocent unborn children, and uh, who do those things that affirm the wonderful God-given gift of life. And we pray that as these children grow in the nurture and admonition of the Lord, and as they grow in wisdom and stature and favor with God and man, that you will put your hedge of protection about them. I plead the name and blood of Jesus over them. And I pray, Lord, that uh, as they face this very challenging and evil world of ours, that they'll know the power and protection of our God. And we just pray, Lord, that each of them will grow to maturity in loving and respecting you. Bless the homes from which they have come, and we ask it in the name of Jesus. Amen. We want to present some gifts to your children and some certificates at this time. Let's give these parents and children a good hand. And now would uh, you join us as the children are taken to either the nursery or to their places here by singing, Jesus Loves Me. Jesus Loves Me This day. 